During tough economic times, issues of hunger and nutrition can become even more pressing. Alachua County in the city of Gainesville recently unveiled an area hunger abatement plan at the community's second hunger summit. Local leaders say the plan focuses on both the immediate and long-term solutions. Meeting the community's food and nutrition needs requires more than donations to food banks and church pantries. It means taking a comprehensive approach to the problem of hunger, especially in a tough economy. The demand is getting higher. There is a recession going on, and so you have people uh, encountering this in a far deeper manner than they have in the past. But there's also some new people that have never been impacted, people that may have had both spouses working, uh, people that were struggling to get by, but now they're, they're falling through the safety net. So in a compassionate community, we have to try to come together and address that need. That's why Alachua County Commissioner Rodney J. Long and Gainesville Mayor Pagin Hanrahan got behind the concept of a community hunger summit last year, bringing together citizens, government, charities, and assistance providers to discuss the issue. The resulting local hunger abatement plan was debuted at this year's summit. It's really focused on things that can actually be done in a reasonable period of time. Uh, some require just local action, some really would take some engagement at the state or federal level, but it's everything from encouraging um, folks who are eligible for different government programs to take advantage of that opportunity and get signed up so that they have a more secure food circumstance. And then the pantries can really be more on an emergency basis and not on a recurring basis. But the abatement plan itself is just the beginning. We're mainly concerned now that our delegation members, federal and state, buy into it. And so when we come to them at the state level or at the federal level, they understand why we're coming and they'll be able to understand the barriers uh, that we believe that are prohibiting people from getting the basic substance of food. And if we're to form a coalition of all of these service providers locally, I think that too will begin to help us to address these issues. The plan seeks to improve communication at all levels of government on food and nutrition issues and also among local service providers through the creation of the Alachua County Association of Nutrition Assistance Providers, who will oversee the plan. Committees formed from last year's summit have been meeting for the last nine months, helping to formulate it agencies were able to get together, literally sit down at a table, share ideas, and share information that they have about what they have available to help uh, county residents. The next step is approval from the Alachua County Commission and the Gainesville City Commission. To view the plan online, visit www.alachuacounty.us for County Update. I'm Alan Yetter.